Let's face this way so we can get some crazy ass lights. Leo Grubalo, Geeks of Metal Age. We're back here with the non spoiler review arrival. I'm here with Kazarad. He's back. So, what do you think of the movie? Uh, did you like it? Uh, yeah, yeah, I like the fact that it was uh, an old school uh, science flick. It wasn't too flashy. It was uh, solid. It uh, makes you think. It was a deep movie, and uh, yeah, I enjoyed it. I'm still you still processing, processing it. it. It's a lot to process. Uh, if you're a fan of the film Contact, don't bother watching this movie. It's the same movie. <laughs> Actually, there's a lot of similarities the more we talk about it. Um, two female scientists uh, signed to make contact with the first aliens. They seem to be the only ones who have the key to it. Uh, they receive the key to it, they figure it out, and then in the third act, we find out what the aliens are here. Not a spoiler, I mean, that's pretty much what the movie is going to be about. How they get there, I guess, is the key. Definitely a slow burn of a movie. Uh, like Rodrigo said, a very old school joint, you know, has that uh, sort of like 70s sci-fi feel to it with a very 21st century special effects. Special effects were good. I mean, you hardly see any special effects. It's a ship and, uh, spoiler, you see the aliens. I got flashes of a day the Earth are still. They're here, right, I love approach the ship, you know, with caution, military, you know, whatnot. What, yeah, why are we here? Yeah. Why are they here? All that stuff. They're right, the military is afraid, of course, and um, the worldwide panic. The, the ships are all over the world, and nobody knows what the hell's going on. It's sort of like here, like being in, in Midtown New York. <laughs> We don't, I mean, we've been off for prostitutes, we've been for drugs. <laughs> After midnight on a Sunday, everything happens. Who would you recommend this film to, I should say? Because it's not a film for teenagers. Teenagers, do not go see this film, you're gonna hate it. Uh, I would recommend this film to uh, old school, you know, not to repeat myself, but old school sci fi fans. Right. Who, who can recall Day the Earth is still the original, maybe? Right. Uh, yeah, it's, yeah it, kind of fan. it's a over 35 film, over 40 film. Uh, it's for us old people. That's right. Uh, but uh, kids are not going to like it. I think the audience we saw it with, they were pretty disappointed. Uh, we saw it in IMAX. Uh, I think we got ripped off. <laughs> <laughs> There's like four, there like four people there. Yeah, it but was nice though. It was oh, oh the fire trucks! The fire trucks! Oh shit! We're gonna run over. It's about to get really loud really quickly here. Yeah. Um, if you like old sci-fi slow burning movies, this is the joint for you. If you're looking for Star Wars, this is not the film for you. It's looking for jump scares. You're not gonna have jump scares. Um, I think the way they treated the aliens was really cool. That, that was very believable. The aliens were not humanoids, uh, per se. Yeah. And uh, it's a lot like Sh Shyamalan film, in a way. Yeah. Uh, M. Night Shyamalan uh, yeah, film? Well, yeah, but I'm trying to figure out why you're making that point. I want to make that point uh, because it's slow, it's murky, uh -huh. and then we don't really find out the, oh, the reason, reveal, the reveal yeah. to the third act. The the the, the, the denouement. The denouement. Les <laughs> denouements, In the third act. Yes, I was teaching Rod the frame denouement. Oh, watch out, Morgan. Oh, watch out. Everyone out of the way. We're getting photobombed by the by the fire department. Yeah, I, overall, I, overall, it's a thinker. It's a it's thinker a th type movie. It's uh, solid as as far as uh, sci-fi goes. I'm, uh, I'll see it again and and. Uh, I think I'll, yeah. I'll enjoy it once more. I mean, I'll say you're thinking about it. Though. You could probably wait for this on video. As Jayla from the block said, it might get loud, <laughs> and it just did. <laughs> I didn't know you were Jayla fan. <laughs> yeah, big Jayla fan. Oh, I think the aliens landed, so the uh, yeah, right. The fire department's gonna go take care of the aliens. Right. S scale from one to ten. I will say, uh, film uh, technical, technically wise, it was a good eight, solid eight. Acting's well done, uh, cinematography, although the projection here was pretty bad. The projection was very flat and colorless. Uh, I don't know if you noticed that. It, it, it lacked color, you know, because uh, the, the, the bulb was turned off, and you've noticed that in that. In the cheap. film was kind of dark and monotone in a way, right? A lot of dark tones. It wasn't too lively. Right, there's a lot of flashbacks, and the flashbacks are see the color. But right, right. Uh, we, we can't say what the flashbacks are. Right, right. That's the payoff in, in the third act. Um, 
I will wait for this on video. I will say save your save your forty two dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow the the show the show was on IMAX and it was on RVX, but we didn't have no RVX experience. Yeah, I I don't see what the deal is with the RVX. It, 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 we didn't have any in this film. We, we, we oh. didn't have any. It right. was supposed to have it, I guess, but we got ripped off. Twenty one dollars a ticket. Yeah. Uh, Mine was free. <laughs> <laughs> but I got the free burger and beer, so <laughs> it all works out at the end. And the juju bees. That's right. Whatever they're called. Snow, Snow caps. Snow there caps. You go. Snow caps. But anywho, uh, yeah, so uh, wait for it on video. Good movie, but wait for it on video. I was That's pleased. A, you were pleased? Quietly pleased. Quietly pleased, yes. But if you like Contact, you will love this movie. Uh, if you didn't like Contact because of the third act, this one has a better third act than a better denouement. That's right. Better denouement than. Um, so, sorry, but you guys are gonna hang out with the Marines now. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> the fleet is in <laughs> for him. Uh, but yeah. troops. Yes. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. But if you like, if you, like I said, uh, it has a better third act than uh, than Contact. All right. All right. Yeah. All right, cool. guys. Uh, See ya.